Craig Jamison's heading to Shepparton with Naked Ambition on Saturday night. And Craig, you had the option to go to Kilmore. Why did you choose Shepparton? Uh, well, just as when the norms came out, there was um, only uh, half a dozen in on uh, Saturday night. So um, then with one more made seven. So uh, we thought for the better money, she um, wouldn't be too far away coming back down that rating band with her mare's claim. So um, yeah, thought it wasn't a bad option. You got the scratching in this race as well, that's also a plus? Yeah, that helps. Yeah, I see one's out, so that's, yeah, leaves half a dozen. So, um, and uh, she comes into two, although probably doesn't make much difference. She hasn't got the greatest gate speed, but yeah, I don't think, um, they tell me she's the outsider in the field. I don't think she deserves to be, but um, yeah, certainly worth, um, not ideal going all the way with one, but I think it's um, definitely worth a crack anyway. She was a big run last time at a massive price. So how'd you come through that run? Yeah, she seems good. Like, to be fair to her, um, she's had the four runs back. If you disregard her gallop, and um, the one time I was disappointed with her was out here, the other two have been really good. I think she's gone as good as she can go. And um, although the form doesn't read great, um, yeah, she's probably going a wee bit better than it, what it reads. So, um, yeah, she deserves a crack up there tomorrow night. And um, it's probably, uh, we just fed her lunch there before, and um, she's... Yeah, she's in good order, so um, hopefully she runs a good race. Um, out of Barandino and Central Otago, obviously hard to beat, but I don't think she's far, far, far from those. If you go back to her first run, she she ran fifth to um, Out of Baron Zeus, Loxley Lover, and Hopeful Beauty. So yeah, I'm sure she won't disgrace herself. A fairly significant driver change as well. You take the steer here. Yeah, unfortunately, Ants, um, he's not going for one. Uh, so yeah, I put myself down. So. Um, probably hence why she's the outsider. You do a lot of the work with her though, what's she like to drive? Uh, yeah, no, she's good now, she's sort of always had a, she's actually, last start was the first time and in, in her work since is the first time we sort of haven't felt that half step she can put in, so which is encouraging because you sort of, as she showed at Bendigo, she um, she can jump out of it, but um, in that sense I've been really happy with her, she's, um, yeah, she's trotting real good and um, with this warmer weather I think, um, you know, she's really come on on the coat, finally, and um, yeah, she's definitely in good shape, so. She's around the $70 quote, uh, are we jumping on? Oh, I think, well, I mean, obviously there's a couple in there hard to beat and the punters know more than us, but um, yeah, I wouldn't surprise me um, if she run up to that, if she run up to those couple of runs prior, um, yeah, I, I can't see why she um, couldn't fill a place anyway, you know.